What is going on everyone? Leon checking in. So today we're here to talk about continued conversation with the Google Assistant and how to set it up. Continued conversation is a new feature that allows you to speak more naturally with your Google Assistant. Instead of having to repeat OK Google after every processed command by the Google Assistant, the Google Assistant stays active so that you can give another command making for a more natural conversation between you and the Google Assistant. So let's go ahead and show how to activate this. So for reference, I'm activating this on a Nexus 6P since I'm recording this video with the Google Pixel 2 XL. Now this can be done on the Google Pixel 2 XL and it runs Android 9.0 and the Nexus 6P runs Android 8.0. Now, depending on things like your Android phone, the launcher you're using, the Android version, this feature may be activated differently or it may not be available on your Android phone. So as always, we're gonna drop a screen recording on this side of the video here so you can see me do this live. And if you enjoy this part of the video, make sure you let me know in the comments below. That way I know this is really helping you out a lot. So on my phone, we're gonna swipe to the right and that's gonna bring us to the Google feed. And then we'll click the three dots in the top right hand corner here and then we'll go into settings then you'll see here we have google assistant at the very top here and we're going to click on settings for that now we're at the main screen here and you can see an item called preferences it's nearly at the top and we're going to click on that and then at the bottom of this list here we're going to have an option called continue conversation we'll click on that and then we'll just turn on continue conversation by hitting the slider and that will change to blue Now let's go ahead and try this out. Okay, so here we are in the living room and this would be the best place to do this because I have the Google Home Mini here, which is what we're using continued conversation on. Now, before we go any further, you obviously know that I have a Pixel Book if you've been watching the channel and continued conversation doesn't seem to work on there. And it also doesn't seem to work on Android, whether it be the Google Pixel 2 XL or the Nexus 6P. So again, this only seems to work on Google Home and that's why we're trying it here. So we're going to start with a simple inquiry that we'll say to Google and then it'll be processed. And then we'll just simply say thank you and Google will say something like you're welcome. Then we're gonna do a more complex inquiry where we're just gonna keep going after Google processes every request that we give. We're just gonna keep going and going and going and you'll just see how much more natural this is compared to if you didn't have continued conversation on. So let's go ahead and start with the simple inquiry. Okay, Google. Turn everything on. You got it, turning nine things on. Thank you. Just doing my job. So as you can see, the continued conversation, it's mind blowing, but it just is more natural. You don't have to say thank you. But for me, I try to get into the habit of just saying thank you anyways. It's just one of those things I like to do and come on, I'm a nerd. So, you know, I had to do it. And then we're just going to do a more complex inquiry. And we're just going to ask a random question and see where it goes. Okay, go back. Tell me about dinosaurs. Dinosaurs are so fascinating. I'd love to tell you about the most dangerous one. Or maybe you're wondering why they went extinct. Why did they go extinct? Sorry, I don't understand. Why are dinosaurs so dangerous? Sorry, I'm not sure how to help. Why did dinosaurs go extinct? Sorry, I can't help with that yet. Okay, so this isn't working perfectly or even ideal like I wanted to for the video, but I'm going to put this in a video just to show it not working. So this is the not working example here. And we're going to go ahead and give this another try. Again, a more complex inquiry. Okay, Google. Turn off the AIM-1 lighting. You got it. Turning the AIM-1 lights off. Turn off the bathroom fan. Okay, turning the bathroom fan off. Change the shower light to red. You got it, changing the shower light to red. Turn off the bar lights. You got it, turning off the bar lights. Tell me the weather today. Right now, it's 61 and mostly sunny. Thank you. That's what I'm here for. So as you can see, that example was a little bit better. 
I was able to do a whole bunch of things without having to continuously repeat. Okay, Google. Hey, Google. Okay, Google. And now I'm doing that and it's activating all these different things. But that's the main point is you don't have to say okay, Google. Google after every request is completed by the Google Assistant. So this is all really cool. Obviously, it's 2018, but the future is finally arriving. And actually, I shouldn't say that because this has been going on for years, not necessarily with the Google Assistant, but just technology in general has just been very fascinating. But it just gets so much better at a faster and faster rate. So that is pretty much it for today's video. If you enjoyed it and found it useful, please make sure you leave a like. If you have any questions or comments, as always, drop those below and I'll do my best to answer them. Now, there are multiple ways you can support the channel. First is hitting that subscribe button. Then there's also Patreon. I'm gonna put that in the description below. So you can go ahead and head on over there and drop a donation if you like. You can also support the channel by going to Instagram and following me at Pixels Cracked. And I'll put that in the description below as well. I also have an Amazon storefront and I'll drop that in the description below. And that just is a place where I have a lot of products that I've unboxed for the channel. And if you buy anything from there, that'll also support the channel. And until next time, Leon, check in out.